Okay, so Halloween is usually the time that I play Animal Jam the most, mostly because I do love Animal Jam around this time. It also has my favorite seasonal adventure, which is the Bittersweet Adventure. Um, so in the Bittersweet Adventure, it has the chest that only specific animals, or in this case pets, can open. So I was just curious how easy or difficult it would be to get good items from those chests. So that's what I'm going to do, and I thought it'd be fun to kind of document it. So I'm going to start with the peacock, and I'm going to play it a hundred times and document um, each item I get. And maybe I'll put it in a spreadsheet or something, because I'm going to do it with the other pets that unlock chests. Um, the other pets that I can do is the bat, the bee, and the cat, I believe. There is also the horse and elephant, but I don't have those. So we're just going to see what happens, and that's pretty much it. Okay, well, I have finished. It's been about a week and a half, but I've finally done it. And uh, first, as you can see, that the peacock and dog have given me no rares or clothing betas, um, which makes sense because if you look at the map, which I will pull up later, the they're in the center, they're right in the body, and they're the easiest to access, so it makes sense. Um, you can see that the spider and cat are the best to go for, which again doesn't quite surprise me since the cat is the farthest away. The There are two pets left, the horse and elephant, that I'm not able to do because I don't have them. If I do somehow require them, I will go get, I will, I will update. But I decided to go further than that and actually document all of the things I've gotten. So, as you can see, the list gets pretty long in the end. And I've also added all of them up. Non-rare in blue, rare in red. I've gotten the most hat and curly wigs. And for rares, I've gotten freedom masks the most. And I've came to the conclusion that the peacock and the dog have separate pools separate loot pools than the other ones because if i would have gotten at least one rare but it is clear that i did not so i'm kind of convinced that they don't have a single rare to offer in them which is okay that's pretty understandable but here's all the pie charts it is the non-rares in the cool colors and the rares in the warm colors As you can see here, I kind of just poorly color coded where each of the pet chest is. So here's the peacock and the dog. So obviously those are right in the center, right next to where you spawn. Gonna get shit items, and then it just goes on. So down here is the bat, the spider, cats up here, bees down there, horse, and then elephant. So yeah. If I do end up obtaining a horse or elephant pet, I will come back and do this again. But as of now, I think that's all from me. I actually do kind of want to do this with Return of the Phantoms. The three chests you get at the end, as well as the Arctic Book chest. So we will see what happens. But anyway, thank you so much.